At home, they call him Dr. Miracle. Dennis Mukwege, a Congolese gynaecologist who's helped countless women who've been subject to sexual violence as a weapon of war. Nadia Murad belongs to the minority Yazidi group, among thousands of women and girls subjected to a systematic campaign of sexual violence by ISIL fighters in 2014. She's now an activist who speaks out for those women who can't or won't. He humiliated me every day. He forced me to wear clothes that didn't cover my body. I was tortured. I tried to flee, but one of the guards stopped me. All those who commit crimes of human trafficking and genocide need to be brought to justice so that women and children can live in peace. They are joint winners of the 2018 Nobel Peace Prize. Both laureates have made a crucial contribution to focusing attention on and combating such war crimes. In its citation, the committee described Mukwege's enduring, dedicated and selfless efforts to end the use of mass rape as a weapon of war. This prize has a big meaning, that although it took time for the world to recognize us, the world has started listening to women. And not just listening, but getting to know the problems that you face. Understanding our problems is not enough. They must realize that when you commit a crime against anyone, it's not right. Both Murad and Mukwege, the committee said, have endured personal risk and cost to combat war crimes and seek justice for victims. In a year in which controversy has touched the Nobel name itself, both with rape allegations against a member of the Swedish Academy that gives out the Literature Prize and with calls for Myanmar's leader Aung San Suu Kyi to be stripped of her Peace Prize, the two winners of the 2018 Nobel Peace Prize are likely to be considered anything but controversial. I asked the chairwoman of the Nobel Committee whether she and her four fellow committee members had decided this year to play it safe. I ask to be believed that we make our decision on the mandate we have in Alfred Nobel's will. Sometimes our decisions are very controversial, sometimes they are not. But being not controversial does not reduce the importance of the prize. In a word then, no. Jonah Holt, Al Jazeera, Oslo.